Welcome back to Blood and Wine. So we actually ended the game, but this is, uh... Us reloading, because... Yeah. We did not get the happiest ending that there possibly could be. You could say. It was not. It was not very happy, so... The vampire route, the elder vampire was not it, apparently. So we're gonna we're gonna go try the other one. See if that's a little better. Let's try it. Okay, let's go to Regis. Um my I was gonna say I was just like way overthinking this when I was like initially doing this. I was thinking, you know, like Regis is like, trust me, and he made a whole vow that she would be fine and stuff, and I'm like, oh my gosh, she's gonna die and it's gonna be tra I thought that was gonna be the tragic thing. I thought that would be the tragic thing. I was so wrong. The dramatic walk to Regis. So this is when Regis is, or Geralt's planning on telling Regis that we're not listening to him, but we're gonna listen to him. So, you decided to talk to Oriana after all. How did you fare? Not well. Oh. Did she not divulge where you might find the Unseen? No, she did. Also divulged her hunger for the blood of small children. Well, I admit I'd heard rumors, but... preferred to lend yeah, them no credence. Really Rather not up. talk about it. Caves west of town, other side of the lake. That's where we need to go. I see. Well, I'm prepared to set out at any time, but... perhaps we could give it one more try. I mean, we were so close. Mm -hmm, but I changed my mind. Yet, perhaps you'd care to reconsider once more? Don't push it, Regis. Orphanage, Deadloff's fault. City gutters are overflowing with blood. Also his doing. And you're worried somebody might have hurt his feelings? Come on. In meeting the Unseen Elder, you will risk all. You cannot be certain to leave with your life. Yet, if we meet Deadloff's demand, the killing will cease at once. Okay, so last night, we said this. We're gonna go find Sayana. We're gonna say, all right, fine, Regis, you win. <sighs> You've worn me down, Regis. Fine, have it your way. Playroom, let's go. Excellent decision. Time Excellent. will tell. Excellent decision? Gonna find out. Thank you guys for being here for this. Beyond the doors, the playroom. Found one of my- Careful! Oh, th what? I, I, okay, hello. I, goodbye, goodbye. I suggest we postpone any further discussion. I, you know? Shit, probably meant to stand guard at Anna Henrietta's personal request. So, I don't know what to expect Locked. out of this. Of course, Regis. Rather not have a fist fight with this door. Do you mind? Not at all. A fist fight with the door. I love it. I mean, we could just use Ard, but he can just unlock it, I think. Thanks. Hmm. Utter silence. No one here. We should look around at least. Okay, this just immediately reminded me of. I think Resident Evil 8? I don't know, something about this like hallway in this area and stuff reminded me of playing that game. I don't know. Something inside? Nope, empty. Well, well, a key tucked behind a picture. Is that a haunted music box? A rocking horse. Rather worn. I suppose it got a lot of use. Wooden duck. Somebody broke its wings off. Allison? Nice tune. Indeed. Is it? Pleasant. Is it? It's a shame the mechanism's damaged. 
mirror, mirror on the wall. I despise these things. Wait, can, wait, Regis, can you see? Can Regis not see himself? Nothing under the carpet. Did you expect something? Apart from the dust swept under there by lazy chambermaid. Miniature tableware and plush toys. Cute. What the? Found a notebook. Property of Isabel de Roquefort, court governess. The notes of Siana and Anna Henrietta's governess when they were little. Oh, do I'm I not get sure it will help, but I suppose there's no harm in leafing through them. Uh, yeah, I want the drama. Please give me the gossip, thank you. Siana gave me a drawing. Siana gave me a drawing today. Charming. Of freshly decapitated bodies covered in blood. And perhaps not so much. I asked her why ever she would draw such a thing. Her Highness claimed it was a rendering of nightmares which have plagued her for as long as she can remember. Siana does wake up screaming nearly every night, save when she shares a bed with Honorietta. Curse of the Black Sun. Supposedly girls afflicted by it had horrible dreams. Kind of horrible that made some of them go mad. The girls quarreled today. I must note rather sadly they did not behave as befits future ladies. The incident devolved into fisticuffs. Anna Henrietta was first to strike her sister. Oh. Siana gave back as good as she'd gotten. By the time I separated them, Anna Henrietta had lost two teeth. She ran off to complain to her parents. His Grace the Duke refused to believe my version of events. He laid all the blame on Siana and vowed to punish the little one harshly. Anna Henrietta did her best to have her sister's sentence commuted, but the Duke and Duchess proved unbending. Once you're labeled a black sheep, it's so hard to shed that reputation. Okay, hang on. I feel like the I... Girl... By the time I separated them, His Grace the Duke refused to believe my version of events. He laid all, the blame, all the blame on Siana and okay. vowed to punish the little one harshly. Anna Rietta did her best to have her sister's oh. sentence commuted. But... Interesting. So they just decided to punish Siana. Didn't even listen to Anna Rietta. Okay. Okay. Today I accompanied the girls for the first time to the land of a thousand fables. We spent half the day there. First we played with Thumbelina, then with Barbarossa, who proved quite the charmer for a brigand and pirate. I'm beginning to suspect Isabel de Roquefort wrote in her diary after taking a powerful hallucinogenic. Cannabis rudelaris, for instance, or... Shh, don't interrupt. I tip my cap to Master Artorius Vigo for his achievement. He has proved he has no equal in the arcane arts. Wait, Artorius was the court mage here, a specialist in illusions, which means... Regis, last warning. Stop interrupting Stop or I'll interrupting. seat you in the corner. <laughs> the girls told me if I ever wish to visit alone, I need but crack open the land of a thousand fables and utter out loud the incantation, Expecto Ludum. A book as the key to an illusion. I buy oh, this okay. grows more interesting by the minute. Gonna be cool, I think. His Grace the Duke expresses concern for his daughters. Mages sent by the Conclave arrived today. They came to examine Siana. I cannot know what conclusions they drew, but His Grace now seems clearly upset. Hmm. Curse of the Black Sun. There's no doubt then that she was diagnosed with the syndrome symptoms. Or had that label planted on her. It goes on. I dared ask the Duke what would become of the girl. He did not reply. I tutored the girls in Nilfgaardian today. Siana applies herself so, though she has great difficulty memorizing new vocabulary. Lady Honorietta seems more gifted in this regard yet also prone to impish behavior. When she thought me out of earshot, she called me a blood accuser. She and Siana laughed so hard they almost choked. I'm assuming that's not nice. Blood is damned, or cursed. What's accuser? In the melodious tongue of our non-too-friendly neighbors to the south, the word describes the many-petaled flower that blooms in that place we so unmelodiously call the crotch. Thank you. Anyways, since there's apparently no more, because 
I would keep reading, but... Mm. Realize this might sound improbable, but maybe, just maybe, Anna Henrietta tossed Sienna into that illusion. Not impossible. She would be safe there, and isolated. We must see. Where's that book? Not the creepy music? Okay, this is gonna be weird. It's creepy in here. Huh. Is it? Let's see. Expecto Ludum. I don't know what I got a screenshot of, but I hope it's cool. If that's the sweet. What? Regis? Where am I? Wait. Regis. Wait. Wait. That's pretty. Wait. Where are the mushrooms so big? Land of a thousand fables. Incredible. Oh, so it's like fairy tale land? Okay, wait. Hmm. That's sweet. Let's see where this road takes me. Okay. Follow the yellow I brick road. It's going I... wild. All land's an illusion, but so powerful there's no way to dispel it. Because, 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 because. Okay. Um, they did it first. Their fault. Girls, welcome to the land of a thousand fables. Set out on a journey of wonder. Enjoy yourselves. Uncle Artorius. Warning, spells will remain stable until June 12, 52. I'm assuming that was in the past? That, that was in the past, right? We're Whoa, like, that should be interesting. What year are we in? 70 something or something? Hmm. Wolfertinger? What? What is that? What is that? Oh, it's like a little... Oh, it's like a bunny bird. With antlers? That's cool. I want to catch it. Where's my pal sphere? <laughs> well, this is cool. Where? There's another area? I'm sorry, how did... And I didn't even see this? Huh? 1275. Okay, I was wondering. I was like, I feel like it's like 70 something. That makes sense. So we're like 20 years after stability. Oh gosh. Oh, I'm dying. 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 Oh my gosh. I almost died. Ah! Hello. Oh, goodness me. Um, okay. One thing. Yes. We have all of our stuff. Okay. It's all equipped. Oh my. Did I have both of those? I did not need to. It's fine. Everything's great. things. Damn it. And this is a playground for two little girls? 
Something's not right. I think it's the fact that the spell wore off. Something, something's not good here. Oh, okay. That, why did he not grab? Let's see what's down here. Sure. This is pretty. Bloody hell, let him out. We gobbled up my gingerbread. Now. Not the gingerbread. <laughs> like what? Oh, um. Hands off my hearth, dearie. You wouldn't want me to get cross. Then you open it. Hello. Now, who's this? A lost traveler? What's supposed to be here, sweetie? Uh, hello, Auntie Ethel. Why, you're old. Old and pale. But never worry. A bit of butter, a bit of spice, and you'll make a tasty morsel. Just as soon as I catch you. She wants Geralt's steam. How do I break it to her so that she cannot have it? Come now, you cannot possibly fear a few magical plants. What do you mean? I definitely fear some magical plants. What are you talking about? I definitely do. I 100% do. I'm quite afraid of them. Okay, um, okay. Hang on, hang on. One thing that's gonna save me right now. Seems you're having a tough go of it. I am having a tough go of it. Alright? I was not prepared for this. I didn't rest. I didn't rest. Okay, not Yerdan, not Yerdan. I hate these things. See, I just need to throw Yurden down. I do so much more damage in my circle. That soup smells more vile than a rotting carcass. Careful she doesn't douse you. Yikes. Can she, like... I need to just live through this right now? About this. I don't know what to do about this. Uh okay, alright, let's let's look at her. Oh, so she's vulnerable during that. I see. Okay, okay. Oh jeez. Right. I was like waiting to see if she was gonna do something different. No, she's not. Um Okay, I need to Ard right at that moment. The broom. Go up against Geralt, what, you know? What the That's hell was that? The wicked witch. You've heard of her, haven't you? Now, where did you put that key? Are they doing the whole Wizard of Oz thing? How do you come by a weapon? Thank you for it's that. Prince what was Charles. that? He no longer needs it. Here it is. What was that camera angle? <laughs> Thank you. She 
you'd have begged me for certain if you'd not... Oh, there was a kid in here. Okay, that's Is good. Is that you? It's been years, Jack. H have you come to play? No, I just want your beans so you can breathe easy. Jack and the beanstalk? Okay. Be beans? Breathe easy? Yeah, okay. Beans, I get it. Magical land. Breathe easy, huh? Breathe easy? Because you aren't here to play? What's that about? Jack knows what I mean. So he'll tell me where the beans are as fast as he can. Isn't that right? Sian, I, I, I'm sorry, but, but I haven't got them. Oh, something tells me you're lying. Perhaps you wish to play the old games after all. Hmm? Uh, this uh, little picky went to market. Um, um, this little picky went home. For instance. It's been ominous. I'm telling the truth. I swear threatening. it. Anarieta, she ordered them buried all over so you wouldn't be able to leave. Where? I, I don't know. B but Joss, the boy with the thing for wolves, he should know. He sticks his nose in everyone's affairs. He had better know. Because if not, I'll find you and we'll have ourselves a little talk. Understand? Now shoot. Ah, all right. So why is it you're here? Looks like a way out, I guess. Trippy. Drew's more welcome. Welcome, everyone. I, they're doing like a whole Wizard of Oz thing here, huh? <laughs> I love it. Um, uh, came to free you, came to look for my lost childhood. <laughs> I... Searching for my lost childhood. Wound up at Care Moore and his little boy. Don't quite remember how. Never had any toys. Never played any games. Uh what do you think? Why might I be here? <laughs> it's Deadloaf. He's trying to force Anna Henrietta's hand. Wants her to release you. Summoned monsters to attack Beauclair. Sounds like Deadloaf, all right. But I doubt you came all this way just to bring me up to speed on current events. So get to the point, please. Isn't it obvious? Offering to be your ally. We both want you out of here. You because you want your freedom back. Me, because as soon as you meet with Deadloff, he'll put an end to the chaos in the city. You exposed me. I landed in prison because of you. Now you come to beg my help, I dare say. My life is full of surprises, isn't it? Well, normally I'd tell you to sod off. But, from what you say, folk are dying who have oh. nothing to do with this. Not part of the plan. Deadloff was only to kill those who deserved it. No one else. Fine, Witcher. I accept your offer. Oh, so she just says yes. Consider us allies. Oh, that's crazy. Shake on it. Okay. So what does that mean? Yeah, so what's the deal with the... What? This place. Tell me something more. It's an illusion, right? Yes. Created by Arturius Vigo. Anna, Henrietta, and I would come here to play out scenes from our favorite fables. Which didn't seem like she was playing. Magical entropy. Without maintenance, the spell gradually disintegrates over time. It grows wild. Your sister chose a dangerous place for your prison. It's deceptive. Provided I don't provoke them, the fairy tale characters don't attack me. But you, you don't belong here. So you had best be on your watch. So they don't attack her, but they attack us. Neat. Neat. Well, that's, um... Okay. <laughs> yeah, the dinner scene. Yeah, the vampires. Anna and Geralt. That was good. That was good. Hmm. So, yeah, so what's the deal? What's... Since you brought so, it up. What, you're good now? The knight's dead love killed. What exactly did they do to you? Crespi, Duak, Aqua, Peyrek, Peyron? Not a memory I enjoy revisiting, but... I suppose you deserve to know. When my parents disowned me, they ordered those very knights to escort me beyond the duchy's borders. All did so without uttering a single word in my defense. Like you said, they had their orders. <laughs> But Crespi was Needs not rest. ordered to beat me unconscious with a horsewhip after my first attempt at escape. 
and Ulaik had no instructions to deny me food and abuse me. I learned something then. Knights are not so chivalrous when no one's watching. Hmm. So we had this conversation with her before, a little less calmly. Last night with our other ending. I told her no excuse for what you did. What if I try to side with her a bit more? All right. This wasn't particularly helpful. So let, let's see. What's Geralt actually going to say? That explains a lot. Shocked, aren't you? You must have thought you had me pegged before bothering to hear my side. Everyone does that. Okay, but why were you trying to like murder all the innocent people though? Like what? Like, okay, come on. Curse of the Black Sun. That's why you were banished, right? Mm-hmm. Twisted princesses, mutants. I'm certain you've heard of us. Even met one of you, Renfri of Craden. And? Was she truly monstrous? She was cruel, that's certain. But what caused it? The curse or what she went through? Asking myself to this day. You killed her, didn't you? Had no choice. Funny. Mum said the same when she tossed me out of the house. Oof. Oof. She's had a tough life. She has. I, I wonder how this is gonna... I, I hope we get a happy ending here. I hope so. Let's see. Can we do it? So, what's she... with the beans? Okay, so Mind she said... Explain. Okay, so she said murdering innocents was not part of the plan. Okay, got it. Sorry, she's, she's telling me a lot of things right now. I'm trying to keep up. Mm, certainly. But you must gird yourself with patience. There are two ways out of this land. My darling sister blocked one when she tossed me in here. The other's up there, in the clouds. She made it hard, but not impossible to access by concealing the beans. Still don't understand. Don't fret, just listen. That boy, that was Jack, of beanstalk fame. You know the beanstalk tale? Beanstalk fame? Jack. Climbed a gigantic beanstalk to a giant's castle, high up in the clouds. As we shall do if we can just find those blasted beans. There are three. One red, one blue, one yellow. Hmm. Huh. Stock won't sprout from just one? No, because it must transpire exactly as it did in the tale. Clear now? So we must find Joss. Perhaps he will be able to help us. Magic. Must be done correctly. Joss can usually be found wandering the glade at the foot of the mount. It's some distance from here, past the witch's house to the right. Okay. So we... There we go. Like, we need a little, uh... Yeah. So, what exactly is happening in the city? Bloodshed. A massacre. Which is why we gotta hurry. Yeah, you gotta help out. It's time flows Everyone's dying. The fables we can stay here a week, yet outside mere minutes will have passed. So you're saying I have time to loot? Cool. <laughs> is that, wait, was there a way in here? I mean, there was, but not really. Okay, I'll go up and around. There, nope. Pretty. Follow the yellow brick road. Yeah, the unseen elder um, ending was not. Watch out, pixies! Obvious. I shall butcher you. <laughs> Very good sword. Put here to protect the Fable Sphere from intruders. Meaning you. Oh my. Okay, well, fine. Oh, look at that. That's pretty. Oh, she's got like the real oh, Hansel unicorns. Tower. We must catch them. We won't have to walk everywhere then. I call the pink one. Unicorns? 
Roach. I like how it calls a roach. I'm so... Unicorns? Like, I... What? And the, the Rapunzel... Ca what? Like, I... What? Oh my. Exciting, isn't it? It is. Reminds me of my childhood. It is. Exciting. Reminds me of something altogether different. Care to elaborate? Rather not. <clears throat> That's too good. That's too good. Okay. That cast, we have the upgraded Ard and Yurden. We got some crazy stuff. With the mutagen powers and all. That's him. Joss. Blast. They're going to rip him in six. There we go, stabby stab. Relax, it's over. No, it's not. There's more. Another wolf behind you. Ignore him. He always lies. Ah, oh. boy who cried wolf. Oh. Still does, I suppose. Oh. And doesn't when they actually appear. <laughs> the one and only. Listen, you little chit. Jack said you know what's become what? of his three beans. I don't know anything. Not one thing, and besides, watch out! Wolves! Sounds like he knows one thing. <laughs> oh my gosh. This'll be interesting. <clears throat> right, let's get to it. Let's say for a minute you know what happened to the red bean. Where wouldn't it be? For nice. certain, no one swallowed it. Oh no, definitely not that. Not that. Of course not. But say someone didn't, who would it be that didn't swallow it? A human! The most human human in the land of a thousand fables! Everyone! Wolves! Run! Okay. Bet you haven't heard what happened to the blue bean. Maybe? Not at all? Right? I've heard it lies mm. about somewhere. Out in the open. Just like that? Yes. No one guarding it? Nobody. Three times over. Help! Wolves! Nobody three times over. Okay, well. He's being helpful in the most roundabout way possible. Yellow bean. Don't know a thing about it, right? Hmm. It's somewhere very, and I mean very deep. So deep, in fact, it's completely underground. And who has it? Hmm? A bald farmhand, who in no way and not at all awaits someone. Not in the slightest. Good folk! Wolves! Say that word one more time and I'll chop you up. <laughs> Feed you to the fishes. He I can't help it. We need some wolves around, then he'll stop. <laughs> what are we eating? Call me crazy, but I, I don't know. Not really, but... I like the little candy hearts. For Valentine's Day. Here's the thing. If you buy them in the boxes and they're all stale and stuff, they're terrible. But if you buy like a nice fresh bag of them, they're yummy. I just like them once a year. <laughs> Alright, we should go. Watch out for wolves! Tough to talk to, that one. Was it, though? You need merely remember he always lies, or more precisely, reverses the truth. Mm. It's opposite day. Where to now? I'm not sure. We should visit some of the other fables, the meaty ones, that is. Perhaps then Joss's hints will the make more sense. The meaty ones? It's just a few. Red Riding Hood, Piglets and Bears, three of each, and Goldilocks, of course. Then Longlocks, and a little lass who sells flint. No Cinderella. Ah, fine. Let's get to work. Now nah, that was Kira. Incredible. 
You must have loved this place. I did at first. But children get bored quickly. Even tea parties with a whole cackle of princesses eventually turn dull and routine. What did you do then? Dropped a duck egg in the swan's nest once. That sort of thing. Just stole the pee out from under the princess. Who sleeps to this day, I think. Oh my. Pastor! Come on, you... You... Know what? They need names! Wait. Is he gonna say Roach? She was saying faster and then didn't keep up with I'll call me. call mine... Hmm. Anise. Call mine Roach. Roach? Are you serious? She's like, are you serious for a unicorn? Uh. Okay, I had to go back for that. <laughs> I don't care that we're getting it. Don't care. That's not what I meant to do. Nope. Okay, that's not what I meant to do. Gosh dang it. That's what I meant to do. Witcher. Hello, girl. Come on. Oh, that's her horse. Excuse me. Roach, let's go. I Roach 2. Unicorn Roach? Like what? Oh, goodness. Let's visit the three three bears. Here we go. Right, how many roaches has Geralt been bears. through? I don't know. Three stools, three beds, three bowls. One a bit too big, the other too small. The third just right. Oh, they're sleeping. Blonde curls. Rest of the body's too mutilated. Hard to say anything. She got what she deserved, as I see it. Always took what she wanted without asking. No being here. Gotta keep looking. Oh, well, she died. Given you no choice. I took their food. I took their food. No! I should have left. Oh no, I've done it now! No, I've done it now! Now I have to murder- No! Sianna, let's leave. Sianna, leave. Sianna, it's time to go. Sianna, no. No. Is she gonna murder them all? Oh, she's gonna murder them all. Oh, she's gonna- Let's dance. No! Not the bear cut. No! Did I just let her die? No, I- I'm sorry. I- No, I should- Now I have to defend her! I stole the food. It's my fault. Okay, here we go. Gosh dang it, I don't want to hurt them! Can I leave? I'm gonna try to leave. I'm trying to leave. I'm trying harder to leave. I don't want to kill them all. I've done it now. I've done it now. Is she coming with? Did she murder them? No, she's still fighting. Okay. All right. I'll just help. Well, I'm murdering the fairy tale creatures if I. If, okay. If I upset them, they try to kill me. Noted. You know, I wasn't expecting that, but I should have been. Don't steal their food. They murdered Goldilocks, or whatever, for that already, so... Can I get him to fight for me? Oh no. I feel so bad. No! Diana, I would have let them live. All right, well, I'm taking all the magic food now. At least get my bread. No, the bears. The bear family, I've murdered them. <laughs> no. Ah, okay, well, um. First encounter went quite poorly. <laughs> What's the magic food do at least? Did, did we at least get some good food out of this? Like, was it... At all... Like, let's see. Nope, it's not special. Let's find out. Only one way to find out. Eat it. Are we magical? We don't seem more magical. That's unfortunate. Um, 
well, time to go. I ate their food and murdered them. I broke into their house, ate their food and murdered them. I, I'm the bad guy. I'm, it is me. Oh no. <laughs> Um, what was I doing? I... Keep trying to do something. Come on, PS5, we good? I think that means we need to get rid of some of the stuff in our inventory. I think that means we have way too much. We need to sell some stuff. That's what that means. Like, look at how many spoons we have. We have so many of them. We have- we have many spoons. Too many spoons. Must get rid of spoons. Not enough places for paintings in our house. The big bad wolf. Can I go in the well? Oh, I can go in the well. I kind of wasn't wasn't expecting that to work. Oh, I was trying to fix my my weapon. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm like, huh? That's what I'm trying to do. Cool. Thank you guys. I'm like, what? Come on, Geralt, speed it up. You're missing some forks? Oh, I can't help with that. Only spoons, only spoons. <laughs> um, so it seems as if... Huh? It is seven years today since we last saw Sayana and Anarietta. The spell is really starting to decay now, and some of the residents of this land are beginning to go mad. There were people living here? The wolf murdered Little Red Riding Hood and the hunter. The witch roasted Tom Thumb alive, along with the seven hen Forzians, and pixies attack anyone who comes near. We sought shelter in the clouds, but the giant drove us away. Our last resort is the ship of King Thrushbeard. You're planning to wait the worst of it out in the middle of the lake. Where did I get this one? Sianna gave me a card today with a headless bloodstained people on it. I asked why she had drawn it. Oh yeah, this was this. Yeah, no, this was this. Okay. Yeah, first we played with Thumbelina, then with Redbeard. Hooray! Weird, so there were like people living here? Huh. Okay, looks like I should just go back. Illusion people. So people, yeah, okay. Trippy. Even weirder. Is here. Is there something else I'm supposed to find here? Is that a person? Yeah, okay, so I already found already found this, right? There's like people here. Yikes. Yeah, I think we just need to get out of here. Okay, which I guess that's the only way out. Never mind. I need to go back up and around. That's what was happening here. Didn't understand. All good. Yeah, let's go, let's go back up there. Talk to the wolf man. You know, I do wish that we had the potatoes here. I should have uh, done the roach quest on this save, probably. We got 69 potatoes, exactly. I, I tried to negotiate 70, she said no. I said, all right. And then she was like, yep. Is that a horse up there? What? Uh, do you... Do you all see what I see up there? There, There's a rooster on top of a cat, on top of a dog, on top of a horse.
that's that's you know that's different this this is this is unique that that is a unique experience okay look at this also like oh my the rainbow and all like look at that so pretty okay what's this though Four animals stacked atop each other. What was the tale called again? The Musicians of Blaviken. Huh. You have some link to the town as well, don't you? Mm. It was a donkey, not a horse, My huh? tale's not much like this one. Oh, Geralt, Geralt. And they call me cruel. Huh. Oh. Let me have a look around. Legs. Uh oh. And ruby oh, red slippers. Yeah, very was a tale about a wizard from Ophir. You might not know it. Ophir, not ours, of course. Yes, Geralt simply isn't familiar. Um. Hello there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save. It's like been a second. I'm gonna save. Save over that one. Hello? Can we talk? Oh. Too much, my head! Damn it all! I swear that was the last time I drank with Redbeard. Uh. Oh, Siana. A bloody long time it's been. You've changed. Oh, they know each other. Whereas you, not at all, big bad wolf. Though it seems you've started running with the wrong crowd. And who should I run with, eh? Thumbelina? One shot and she's under the table. But, 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 what brings you? <laughs> okay. Um. Have a drink first. You could always have a drink with us. Oh, what now? Not on your life. I can barely stand, I'm so hungover. You know what they say about the hair of the dog? Out of the question! And why must you drink? Do you wish to drown they some sorrow? Not. And I don't mean to pry, but you don't look much like a young duchess to me. They stripped me off my title and birthright, then banished me. A family spat, let's say. Oh my. She's not looking fancy enough? Listen, looking for magic beans. Seen any? I was given one for safekeeping, but... Where is it? Talk! Shh, not so loud. Oh, I can be much louder than this. And resort to other means of persuasion. Oh, uh, right there, the threats. Sianne to a T. <laughs> Listen, I exist to restage a fairy tale. If you want to play at it, I'll be happy to oblige. But it won't be easy. The thing is, little red riding hoods popped her claws. So these are the residents. What? A thousand times yeah. they cut my gut open, filled it full of rocks, and drowned me in the river. So once you stopped coming, I decided to repay the little imp for all her loving labor. Good <laughs> now, what's at the bottom of the well? She and the hunter, which means we can't play, and I'm under no obligation to talk to you. Amazing not voice. about beans, nor anything else. So leave me be. Sort of. Amazing voice. <laughs> so these are the residents of the of the letter that they were mentioning, and they've uh, not been doing the best, it seems. Hmm. Wolf's pretty cranky. Uh huh. Surprised? Think about it. He was cast in the role of the nemesis without ever asking for it. It's a dog's life, I tell you. So, what now? Don't worry. I'll play with him. Or rather, play him. I just need that little red hood. The piece of apparel, that is. Not the poor girl's corpse. That's a relief. You wish to help me? Here's your chance. Jump in the well oh, and fish Oh, now it we out. go. Well, chop chop. Jumping ahead of myself. I 
like I shouldn't go in the house. All right. Time to jump in the well. I want to have to kill the wolf, too. There they were. Yep. He's cute. Little Red Riding Hood. Not, not doing too well. That's exactly how French people sound. Yup, totally, totally. <laughs> Still amazing though. I, it, I don't love it because it's anything close to being accurate to like French or anything. It just that's a that's a great voice. That's very iconic. I love it. Wee <laughs> wee. <Oui, oui. laughs> Okay, where to next? Any luck? Yep, look what I got. That would never fit you. Give it to me. Well, did we even try? How do I look? Oh, fancy? She wants a compliment. We could give her one. We could always go that I feel like this is a very Geralt answer. Don't know much about fashion. So so I <laughs> I'm just trying to be nice to her. Let's see what happens. Not bad. Not bad at all. I mean Let's go see the big bad. Wolf. What's that look? Let me guess. You'll play the granddaughter. Mm-hmm. And you, the hunter. I don't know if Geralt needs any more romances. You again? I thought I was clear. I will not talk to you if little Red Riding Hood is not with you. Not a problem. Sienna can take her place. What? <sighs> Very well. It's not as if I can forbid you. <laughs> Granddaughter, come closer, sweetie. But, Grandmama, what big eyes you have. The better to see you with, my dear. Granny, what this is weird. big arms you have. The better to embrace you with, my dear. And, Grandmama, what big teeth you have. Hey. The better to eat you is, my dear. Oh, okay. Oh. We're not killing him, right? We're just defeating. Not permanently, I hope. Maybe is that will that release him from this place? Maybe is that is that nice? Like. I, oh my gosh. Just said that about the red dead. bean. A human has it. Yeah. But he definitely didn't swallow it. Mm -hmm. Gotta open Honestly, his belly. probably for the best, like I was saying, you know? Um, because that was weird. Bottle caps. Fake that was teeth, weird. The corkscrew. Ah, here it is. Doesn't red seem like bean. they were thriving here, so you know, um Well then, one step closer yay? to our goal. What? Now I find myself wondering if you're just horribly discreet, or if those mutations completely scrubbed away your curiosity. Are you really not interested in what happened? In what became of me after they cast me out? You're just less interesting than you think. <laughs> no, tell me what happened. Well, since you brought it up, I'd gladly hear the rest. Let's see. They had escorted you out of the duchy. Yes. And the noble knights of Toussaint and I didn't stop until we reached the Ketdu wilderness. They left me there alone, without a copper, in a torn lace dress. 
right when the frosts were setting in. They assumed something would eat me, or that I'd do everyone a favor and die of hunger. But as always, I failed to live up to expectations. I wandered the woods for a week, went purple from the cold, gnawed the bark from twigs. Finally, I saw a light among the trees, a campsite. They were bandits, bearded, drunk, spattered with blood. I was sure they'd rape me or kill me, or both. Take it neither happened? That's when I learned a robber and a murderer can be a better man than a knight in shining armor. They took me in, we set off for Nazaire, and I did what I could to repay them. I advanced in their ranks rather quickly. Eventually, I became their leader of the whole ragged band. Is that like rude? Maybe you should have stayed there? I mean, she was their leader, so she was doing well there, but, like, that's there. I'm assuming that's not... Curious to see her take on that. Should have stayed there, maybe. Perhaps. Perhaps I should have forgotten everything, started a new life. But you know what? There came a point when I thought, you wanted a monster. Then a monster you shall get. Oof. But you didn't have to do that. You don't have to hurt yourself to hurt other people, right? Like, oh no. Been through a lot. I have. And throughout this time, my sister was stomping grapes and shagging minstrels on down bedding. She wasn't the one to yeah, banish you. And I'm did. not angry at her for that. I'm angry at her because she forgot about me. Oh, she wanted her to go right. after her. We've had our chat. Oh. Come. She wanted her to go after her. Did I loot? I did not. Seems important, whatever I just picked up. We need to get rid of stuff. That is taking way too long to load. <laughs> Fake tooth, corkscrew, bottle caps. Huh. Some more magic food. Doesn't seem that magical. Magic gold? That, that's kind of magical. All right, where to next? This one Did you like Anna Henrietta? You jest, I adored her. My darling little sis. So adorable. So sweet. Yet when they banished me from the palace, she didn't so much as peek out of the window. She might not have known. Maybe just couldn't. And could she also not grant me amnesty when she was crowned? Please. Huh. What is this place? What is this little house? Come on, gotta be something here, right? Maybe something for later? Hmm. Pretty. This is just gonna take us to the tower. Long locks. Ah. Rapunzel. <laughs> What is this? Oh, okay, wait. Go the see three the little, little pig's homes. But you know the story, don't you? Who's afraid of the big bad wolf? Looks like big bad's already blown down the houses of straw and sticks. Brick's the only one left. We should look inside. Remember Joss's words? Mm -hmm. One bean lies out in the open, guarded by three nobodies. Yeah, it could be it. Guarded by three nobodies. Maybe. I'm assuming we definitely need to go up in the tower, but I want to go check out everything, because why not? So we'll, we'll probably save the tower for last. Um. Oh, oh, God. Get 
Get him. Uh, uh, I broke their house down. I broke the their house didn't down. Like that. No. Wait, he has a little hat on? No, I don't want to hurt the pig with the hat. The pig with the hat wants to hurt me, though. I did, I did ruin their whole house, which, like, is fair. I'm, we, are we the big bad wolf now? Oh, no. Wait, we have entries for them? Wait, the big ba the big bad wolf? Oh my gosh, once he served as a playmate to the Duke's daughters, acting out scenes with a certain red, red hooded girl and her grandmother, but as the fable land slowly degenerated, so did he. They met the big bad wolf while he was nursing a nasty hangover and was not eager to cooperate. How about the three little pigs? Why bother with brick? In this climate, even a straw house is nice and cozy. Oh no. The three little pigs are perfect examples of a rather unfortunate phenomenon. Leave even a kind-hearted, warm, naively benign creature to fend for itself, and it won't remain, remain so benign for long. Three little pigs from the land of a thousand fables were left for years without Artorias Vigo's supervision. During this time, they went completely feral, transforming into three wild boars which attacked anyone who dared approach their ruined home. Oh, they have cute little hats. Why are they making me the bad guy? I don't want to be the bad guy. What? This is what? Oh no. No. I've murdered them. That's one beam, Tom. Good work. Oh, well, that was actually the magic beams, so that's fair. Okay, wait, can I can I loot? There we go. Magic dust. Blue bean. The big bad witcher huffed and puffed, and look, got a bean. Woo! It cannot be. What cannot be? You actually have a sense of humor. She likes Geralt? Is that strange? <laughs> Why so shocked? Come on, sassy well, Geralt's great. When you arrived, all you did was pout and mumble things in that graffily monotone. And now this. You don't like his voice? Yes, rude. And a good one at that. But here we are chatting away when there's work to do. We must keep looking. So, do you like it here? Break it further. No, got a problem with magic in general. Illusions, portals, all that. Don't trust any of it. A bow of old-fashioned tastes, eh? I like that. <laughs> yeah, I I assume that the tower seems like the last last spot. Oh look, so the Emperor look. of Nilfgaard. He's come out to show off his new robe. Uh, what? My new attire reveals itself, but to the wise and cultured. Stunning, are they not? My new robes, absolutely stunning. Ah! Looking, looking good, Emperor. Such exquisite robes, the world's never seen. Never seen them. True. Oh my. Small. So small. Hello. Hey. Okay, can I maybe, like, not destroy everything here? Hello? Hey! Watch it! Oh. I don't think she wants us here. The door is locked. Can't go inside. That's the only reason we can't go inside, though. Um... Okay. I think we found where Thumbelina lives. Watch out, pixies!
The girl who sells flint is up here. All right. Let's see. Yeah, awesome how she kept the red cape. She totally didn't need to. She's having fun, too. Okay. Puss? Puss in boots? Tobacco of the highest caliber. Fist tech pure as virgin tears. Puss in boots? Oh my gosh, I love it. Care for a cigarilla? A bit of tobacco? A dab of fist tech? Uh, remind me. What tail are you from? Sold flints when I was a lass, but no one bought them, so I branched out. Now I deal in snuffs, puffs, all sorts of fun things. What'll you have, sweeties? Um. Magic beans. Do you have any? If it's not the new name of some kicker I already have, dearies, then no. But maybe you'd like some. Um. Hey, where'd you get that ribbon? That's mine. Is that so? Then why was it lying in the bushes? Um. Find us keepers, sweetheart. That's um what's the deal? The ribbon. Mind explaining what the fuss is about? There's not much to explain. I got it from a Torius Vigo when I was a child. It was to protect me from ethel. It clearly didn't work, given how I ended up. But it means a lot to you. How should I put this? I have so few mementos from my childhood, and the ribbon reminds me of the good old days. When I was someone else. Dears, could you continue this touching scene elsewhere? Hmm? She's like, yeah, I don't care. Skank where my customers. <laughs> the cat with the boots. Is this a bad idea? Give Sienna the ribbon. Why not, huh? Sugar plum. That's something about protecting her from evil. The only thing I hand out for free is a first hit. To get them to come back for a second, of course. Oh, for all else, good. You've got to pay. What if I asked you nicely? Ask me nicely and I might play you for it. A round of cards? Gwen? All right. I got this. All right, let's play. If you lose, you give me the ribbon. Don't get your hopes up. None can best me at Gwent. Mm. All right. Play Gwent for the ribbon. Um. Here we go. Okay. One spy. Not enough. Um, let's try to swap. No, I need a spy. Gosh dang it. It's alright, we're gonna get more spies. first. Random. Okay. No more spies. That's unfortunate. Okay. I'm gonna throw... Oh, I can't throw the eight down. I'm gonna throw... go. Quinn, thank you so much for that sub. Appreciate the tier one. Thank you for 15 months. Thank you for supporting the stream and the Partner Plus push that we have and just appreciate it a lot. Welcome back. How's it going? Okay. Um, yeah, we're just gonna put that down. Zoop. 
And let's pass. Seriously, no spies? Okay. Wow, that's unlucky. That's really rare for us. We're just, that's very unlucky. We have like a significant amount in this deck. Um, well, that's all good. We will work with what we've got. Let's... Oh, jeez. We don't even really have a way to effectively use these medics and stuff. So, let's see what happens. I'm just gonna start throwing down some cards. Let's, let's go. You know what? Let's put Old Gear there. So if I need to, I can consider passing on this round with the medics and the decoys and all, so we'll see. just for wasting time than anything else. He, like, barely has any cards down. Or she is playing the girl for the ribbon. Yes. Always gotta remember. I, I swear, I start playing Gwent and I'm just, like, transported to a unnamed Witcher Tavern somewhere in space. You know? I'm there. <laughs> 15? I mean... Sure! lose this round, so we'll see. <sighs> do I scorch or do I pass? I don't know if I want to play any more of my cards, like regular ones. I could do. Okay, so if I want to put this, push this to a third round, I could put the medic, bring the cow, and then decoy and grab the medic back for the next round. I'm gonna try that. I'm bringing back the cow. Helps waste a little time, too. to decide if I want to clear that up or not. We'll see. Not sure yet. They passed? Why? Okay. Um, with three cards left? With three cards left? That's really random. But alright. Now skedaddle. Alright, well we got a ribbon. Don't know if that's gonna be important or not. Guess we will see. How's that look? Huh. Alright. Tell me. What? What you want in return. You're not doing this out of the kindness of your heart. Don't want anything in return. I... Hmm. Thank you. Oh, 
Okay. One last look around. A billy goat. Wait. Is he wearing something? It... <laughs> Hello there. Anything to see? Anything else? I think we found stuff to find. Well, here we have it. Tower. Indeed. It's even taller than I remember. Wait. What Joss said about the third beam, remember? In the possession of a bald farmhand somewhere deep beneath the ground. A bald yes, farmhand. This must be it. Let's go. <laughs> okay. What are we doing on levels? So. Yeah, we need some more ability points to keep getting the... Oh, let's see if we can get that one if we have a greater red mutagen. Or greater green. Did I make any of those? PS5's struggling a bit right now. Kind of lagging. We have apparently way too much in our inventory for the PS5. Right, where is that girl getting all her goods to sell? I don't know. The one with the ribbon? Hmm. Should I take me visiting Poland? Oh, maybe someday. That could be kind of cool. Maybe any gaming conventions or something out there? It'd be kind of sweet. The goat in the red pants is from a Polish fairy tale. I was wondering. I'm like, I don't, I don't recognize that, but that looks fun. Okay, so let's make sure, oops, that we save. I'm gonna save there. Cool. It always grapple up her braid in the past, but I don't see it anywhere. We'll find another way up. Could pull myself up here, and I'll have to make that jump. If you say so, I shall wait down here if it's all the same. Climbing's not my strong suit. Like, have fun. Okay, thank you. Prince's corpse. Tried to free long locks, but fell and broke his neck. That's nice. She's like, oh, thank you. You're coming to save me. Oh, there he goes. His neck's broken. Like. <laughs> like the rainbow. Is there something at the end of the rainbow? Looks like there's a path over there. Is there something over there? Something I should see? I don't know. Some stuff like that can be for a future playthrough, too. There is, and um, yeah, I'm assuming there is. Oop, nope, not Geralt. Geralt. Oh, Geralt almost died. Everything's fine. at the end of the rainbow. Hmm. There's a notice board by the Flint girl? Really? I might need to go there. Geralt needs a glider or something. Why can't I just go to like just glide over there? I've been playing too much Power World lately. I'm like ready to just woo. Do I go to the rainbow? I, now I need to go to the rainbow. Gosh dang it. I'm going to the rainbow. 
I, I, I'm now curious. I hope it's worth going to the rainbow. I need to know. I, I must. I'm gonna just be uh, like, ah! ah! Well, that's one way to get down. There, there's, there's Rapunzel's next savior. Neck snapped. Okay, well, um. <laughs> uh. <clears throat>best moments of the game thank you i'll make sure to put this up on youtube as well so definitely keep an eye out for that doesn't seem to be at home a feather feathers broken there was a fight uh oh a feather broken there was a fight uh oh goose feathers must have been flapping its wings when did it just get plucked watch out pixies Okay, I need to help the cats after this. They're like yelling at the door. I'm gonna help the goose and then I'll help help the cats. Okay, follow the tracks. Where? Here? Here we go. This way. And here. Hey, there, in the trees. Is Mrs. Some Goose kind of okay? Cow. Oh my. You paint the goose! The golden X whipping out! Can I hang your head from my saddle? You stay away from the goose. You mean to cross the barbers, Barbarossa? Not on your life! How are there bandits in this place? Like what? With my keeper in a cage. Eggs from free range birds are so much better. Oh well, where's the key? He's like, come on, they're not even doing it right. Where's the key? Which one of them have I not looted yet? This one. Here it is. Got it. Honk honk. Oh, geese are so cute. Good thing you posted not that notice. Vicious. Never would have found you otherwise. Look, she laid a golden egg for oh, you. Oh, <laughs> neat. <laughs> if only all my employers were that generous. Would have preferred a magic bean, but not about to complain. Neat. Did you really golden travel egg? all the way here for a contract? Nature of the job. I don't believe it. You must have had another reason. Hmm. Well, spent a few idyllic months in Eau Claire some time past. Part of me wanted to come back, I think. Oh, yes. Visit Toussaint once, and you'll always long to return. Oh, I love it. The goose contract. All right, now I think it's time for the tower. Um, I need to help the cats real fast. They're, they're screaming to be let in, so let me get them set up real quick. Okay, so is there... Yeah, there's no way to go there. Okay. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. The movement sometimes scares me. Yeah, it auto saves frequently. It does not look like there's a quick save. Okay. Made it. Door. Still not the door. Okay, door. Door. Yes. Door. More doors. No. They do no. They knew not no, you're jo- Not Rapunzel! Not Rapunzel! Oh my god! What? What is this? Not Rapunzel! What have they done? That is so dark! Oh my god! Oh my god! This game! Oh my god. 
Assets. <laughs> okay, that's, that's good. That's good. Alright. <laughs> have to fight the wraith of long lock. That's <laughs> can I can I bring her some peace at least? Oh my. Not by the hair. You got It's so messed up. Oh my god. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> Another bean. There it is. Would have stunk to climb all that way for nothing. Okay, if you guys had like a table that like did that, you could choose like one food to put it put on it. What would it be? First thing that came to mind for me is chocolate chip cookies. But I feel like there could be some other good options, too. Expensive toys. Random. Strawberry- like, fruit? Fruit could be good. Well, um... We... we went up in the tower. Ah! Shall we walk in the plank? Like, oh my gosh. Okay, it's really pretty though. Oh, look at that. Wait, what's... That's with the castle up on the hill. That's cool. Huh. Geralt's on the balcony. I love Geralt's face. Oop, nope, there. Okay, there. His... Geralt has seen too much. <laughs> oh! Okay. Oh, that's scary. I did not I did not Oh my gosh. Okay, you can actually do that. I literally... I pressed B on accident. So? Got the bean, but long locks. Seems okay. She got sick of waiting for a knight in shining armor. That worked? Can you blame her? Men these days, <laughs> dandies and fops all. That why you cozied up to a vampire? Dead laugh was a tool, and only a tool. Oh, Too poor bad Detlaf. he didn't know that. Oh, poor dead laugh. I trust no one. Learned that long ago. Now it's his turn. She's like, I'm upset. I must make the whole world upset. Like, no, okay. I <laughs> Oh, that was good. Yeah, what's your deal? You, did you never care about him at all? Like, what? What? To use him. Was that your plan from the start? No. At first, I was simply intrigued. Do you know the story? It was in Matina, a few years past. I had gone there to pass some woo talk to a fence I know. We were hashing out the terms when in walked Detlaf. He said he'd come to sell a silver candlestick. He gripped it through a cloth. That caught my eye. <laughs> I followed him out, observed him from a distance, but he caught on quickly. Yeah, superhuman senses will do that. He turned down a blind alley. I followed. He jumped out from behind a crate, baring his teeth. I suppose he'd wanted to frighten me. Alas, he didn't in the least. After all, I'm a monster too, am I not? You, but you you think of yourself as as a like as bad as a vampire, okay? I mean, vampires are pretty scary in this world. A higher vampire, and you were unimpressed. Don't know if that's brave or just plain foolish. I've always had a way with ostensibly dangerous, quiet types. That's supposed to be about me too. Ugh, oh, mother, I hate to disappoint you, Geralt, but your belly button is not the center of the known world. No. You do remind me of him a bit, stifling all emotions inside you, ever feigning indifference. You see, when I met Detlaf, I... Somehow I knew, call it intuition, that he meant me no harm, 
that he was trying to frighten me off, for he too was scared. Now do you understand? I guess. Girl's like, maybe? <laughs> sort of? Uh... <laughs> What happened then? We talked, then met up once, twice, three times. Enough that he became infatuated. I truly enjoyed it at first, but only at first. He did not love like a man, but like an animal, madly, deeply, unconditionally, wildly. To return such a feeling, anyone would be hard-pressed, let alone someone as twisted as I am. So there came a day you just up and disappeared. Well, yes. He cared too much. There was Gross. No way. Let's just be friends. Or I don't <laughs> deserve you. He'd never have understood that sort of thing. But then, once I decided to return, clean up some old affairs, I remembered him and concluded he could still be of use. Playing with fire, that. Definitely. And either I'll get burned or I'll burn all else down. No other options. Uh, okay. It's certainly an attitude. Um. I, I, hmm. Got a history with Detloff now. So this meeting will be different. Not afraid. I can handle him. Mm hmm. Sure about that? You look at him as a witcher and see a monster. I. I know what he's really like. You, you don't worry. Okay, but did you see him go. destroy the town, Just though? Just a bit more work, and we'll be able to say sort off to this fecking fable sphere. Detlaff and Regis together, that whole, like, cloud intro now thing they did. Them by the path near Longlock's okay. tower. Then prepare to meet the giant. Scary. Giant? Oh. Okay. Right, this is the spot. Pull out the beans. Frost for the plants. <laughs> Wait. What? The stalk will sprout abruptly, very abruptly. We must be careful. Uh, what does that mean? All right. Oh, okay, thanks. <laughs> Like a bomb? Are you supposed to put some soil on them? Like, add some dirt on top? Like, a little sprinkle of water? Come on. For the guy in the background. Like, <laughs> I don't know if he's supposed to be there. I love it. Uh, something's always gotta go. There it is. There it is. The home stretch. Soil, water, sunlight, and time. Okay, Geralt, wait, what was that grab? I'm sorry, what? Y okay. She didn't say anything. <laughs> uh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Safety first. Admire the view later. First, we must deal with... What? Why do things seem weird? What's weird? Him. Oh. Oh. She didn't mention a boss fight. 
Okay, here we go. Hardly working. I don't know. The cursed one's oil. Is that what that is? I think we got that right. Okay. Okay, Ard is like our best friend. And it makes our art a crazy power. I love it. For a okay. fairy tale creature, that was one tough son of a wench. I told you this land had gone that was simpler mad, than yesterday so far. I did not expect it to be so severe. Can't help thinking you might have done that on purpose. Why ever would I have? To get rid of your guard, your captor. Getting close to the exit at this point. Probably think you don't need me anymore. Well, you're wrong. You still stand to be quite useful to me. Uh huh. What is her deal? Also, yeah, no, she definitely did um, mention the boss fight, I suppose. I just was not preparing it at that moment. Or expecting it at that moment. I love it, though. Uh. So far, that was a lot simpler than um, the boss yesterday, uh, the Elden, the Unseen Elder or whatever, you know, that whole path. That was, that was tough, so there's going to be another one, though, for sure. We'll see. Don't tell me. What's the deal? Useful? What are you talking about? Huh? That's so? How? Plan to use me like you did Deadloff? No, I need you for a purpose far simpler. Well, don't just stand there and stare. Uh, I oh, need a man, Geralt. Oh. And I'm not afraid to say it. I have no idea what awaits me once we leave it, this place. Are you serious? Treat it as my last wish. Let her have her way with you? Like, I knew that we were, like, flirting, but, like, I did not... Huh? We're flirting with Sayana? She was gonna try to kill her sister! She was gonna try to kill her sister! She was gonna try to do it! Thank you, I appreciate the bits. What? The last wish. Okay, she does say, treat it as my last wish. It does say it's her last wish. It is February. Valentine's Day? I'm for for the for the romance? Oh jeez. Okay, here we go. Sorry, Yen. Sorry. My bad. Fresh no, not a kid. No, 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 no. Nope. <laughs> Oh, we're like in the class. What is this? What is this? What is. This? Okay, there's flickering happening too. What is. What am I watching? Well, that's that's a scene. Okay. 
so a bit of a different vibe here than um like the boat with Shawnee, you know? Um I mean, she did warn us. Like, we did have the option, so... <laughs> okay, Geralt. Well, there's the many adventures of a witcher. Um, sorry, Yennefer, once again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Just gonna go our separate ways? No parting words? Did you wish to tell me something? Actually, <clears throat> that'd probably be best. Oh my. No woman's ever treated you this way. Not that I recall, no. In that case, at last you felt what so many women in this world feel at times. <laughs> I hope this tale has a happy ending. No, let's... Let's... Let's just go. I think it might be time to get out of here. <laughs> Couldn't agree more. Ah. Come, the exit's this way. Well, oh, yeah, I forgot about. <laughs> I was just thinking about Yennefer. Um, which hmm. I don't think she cared about that laugh. Which probably makes it all worse. I don't know. Sorry, dead lab. Can I loot? Can I loot? It says there's a dead body. There we go. <clears throat> Anyways. Continuing forward. Another will of the wisp. Where are we going? Down? Oh. Oh. Where? Oh. Sienna said they were suspicious, but I'm I'm trusting it. It's the Dark Souls thing. Okay, it's okay. It's the Souls. Okay, right. Okay, that looks very Souls-like. We were resting at the, the bonfire, right? I don't know. In the cave. Is that. Am I picking up on that vibe? What did we get? Is that from Dark Souls? Okay, so I've I played Elden Ring. I played Bloodborne. I haven't played through Dark Souls much. They actually initially scared me away from. The Soul series. I, I need to play through those. I need to conquer my initial fears. I'm no longer afraid of them. I just am afraid of the time commitment right now. <laughs> I love it though. What's the, what's the lore behind the sword? What's what's that one? Go on, jump in the well. Just curious. <laughs> Why do you want the heart of Toussaint and the ducal wine? They were my right. My Jew. Doubt we would have figured you out if you hadn't tried to get them. Know that, don't you? I do. And I regret nothing. She's like, yeah, I don't care. One lives but once. YOLO. Like, what? <laughs> okay. Here. We need but jump into the well. You first. Oh, we're actually jumping into a well? Oh. Okay. I mean, I guess so. Well, well, well. That's a long fall. Oh, what are we getting into? Oh. Oh, this Portals is exciting. In a fountain? Not terribly practical. It was a secret Portal. passage. Anarietta and I would use it to hide from your governess. Which, luckily, she noted down in her diary. Thus, I knew where to await you. Yeah, Regis. Uh, never mind that. Has the young lady agreed to help clean up the mess she's made? 
She has. And stop treating me as if I were a child. Would you prefer I treated you like the lying manipulator you are? Ooh! Okay. Okay. <clears throat> if I have learned anything. Playing Baldur's Gate. Baldur's Gate 3. It's that when, when two characters are, are having a disagreement, it is extremely important that you consider what you say to them and whose side you take. Because if you take a side, sometimes one of your other companions ends up with a knife in their throat. Permanently. Forever. So, so there's, there's that. It makes me afraid. It makes me afraid. In Baldur's Gate, in that situation, if you do not take a side, you still may have to roll, like, to, to do, like, a roll or a check to make sure that, like, something bad doesn't happen still, but it seems less likely than if you did take a side. So, I don't know. Um... Smart to save the game? No, we don't reload here. Well, I didn't reload when Lazel got stabbed in the throat. Oh wait, we don't we don't reload here. Like unless something is is horribly unless like something needs to happen, unless something is technically wrong. That's what second playthroughs are for. Right. <laughs> um You know, the stakes gotta be high. We gotta have high stakes. We gotta freak out a little bit. Okay. Um I, I'm, I'm not, I'm gonna not take a side. If I had to take a side, I'm definitely taking Regis' side. Like, 100%. But I'm gonna try to not take a side. Yeah, there's Lysol. If you guys didn't see, that's the video for you. It's right there. Wait, like, five seconds, it'll happen. Um, yeah. So... Yeah, no, it's first first time. I don't know what to do. I know this is so important. I'm going back and forth between calling out Sayana and telling both of them stop. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I'm gonna not take a side. Both of you stop. Calm down, both of you. But no buts. It might not be that big of a deal, but I don't know, Lazel. Let's uh. go. Really want to be done with this. What was that look? What was that look? That was a plotting look. That was scheming. She's scheming. What is she plotting? Hmm. I'm uneasy now. I hope I chose the right thing. I don't know. That affected... Something potentially. Nice place. Don't know. Isn't it? We'll see. Offers a lovely view of the valley. On a clear day, you can see the outlines of Duntine. I just, I feel like our relationships level, like, or something with them might matter. Like, I don't know. That's like what I feel like. Is it, though? A ruin like any other, I think. Ah, uh, so sensitive. So aware. Honestly, what did Declaf ever see in you? Perhaps he'll tell you himself. Nervous? You nervous? Mm-hmm. It's always a bit nerve-wracking meeting an ex. Especially so when said ex is a vampire. I doubt he'll be in the mood Fair. for jests. I know. Oh, may Bella I Swan be honest? Would disagree. Well, yes. He was nervous, I suppose. I'm nervous. I really would prefer just Eager. to run off. I gave my word I would help, I know. But how much is that worth? Yet I owe him this meeting. And that is that. Let's see how this goes. Let's get ready. Deadlock will be here any moment now. Maybe everyone can maybe not die for this time compared to the other ending we got yesterday.
Like waiting for Gaunter to like pop out of the sky or something again. Like what? A single crow. What did it say? It spoke. was a ruse. Dead oh. love. It's not that simple. I... Oh, no. It's very oh, simple. she's going... You either deceived me or not. Oh. In forgiving you, I grieve. For now, we must part. <laughs> what? Oh. But how? Oh, the ribbon! Right? Protect? That's what that- uh, Right? No? Maybe? Something the protected ribbon. her. Yes, the ribbon! Ha! Seems I've been fooled again. Oh my god, or she was so gonna die. She oh my god, are you joking? Are you joking? She's she gonna die? Oh my god, that you was that important? Metal, oh my god. Whoa. Okay, here we go. Yeah, so it looks like if I didn't get the ribbon, she's dead there. Is, is that correct? Oh my god, I'm happy I went and explored. There's- okay. Oh gosh, okay, we're back here. Oh, this is the same fight as yesterday that I did like ten times. Alright, I got this. First try today. Ready? Oh, we're still fighting Detlaf? Does he still die? <gasps> Oh, the drama. Oh, okay. Um... What do I do here? Uh, we're preparing. We're preparing. So I want... I want that. And I want that. And I want to make sure... I got that vampire oil on there. Perfect. Beautiful. Here we go. <laughs> So creepy! Regis! Oh. Oh. Regis, now we must do this fight for you. Oh, so you skipped it? Oh, so this doesn't happen. You tricked me. Both of you! Didn't plan any of it. Silence! This team has a lot of different outcomes and stuff. It's pretty really cool. It seems like there's a lot of things that can happen, and even, even like the big main outcome, there's like a lot of small things that can happen. Ard, when we are standing in our Yodin circle, does so much damage. We have to be in the circle, though. Any gods, start praying now. Okay, can I do this? Nope. That's
Okay, I'm a moment late. I'm, I'm getting it though. Alright, there go the wings. You can never dodge the bats, neither can I. <laughs> Alright. Third phase. This is what was giving me a hard time on our other ending. Silver sword, we're equipped. Oh my gosh. Um so our toxicity is not ideal. Um I don't really want to cancel everything though. Isn't there something? Yeah, that neutralizes effects of poisons. That won't help me, right? I don't think so. The main thing is we have the echidna potion. So we just need to keep casting that kind of stuff. Okay. Sorry, Detlaf. You kind of turned into a whole scary monster. Didn't love that. That was kind of gross. Don't do that. Don't ever, don't do that. Sorry. Fight. Leave him to me. Be gone. I can't let him. I insist. Just 
still drinks his blood this way. Oh. So maybe it would have been good to let Sayana die. I wonder. Oh, that'll be different. I wonder if that would be a happier ending for Regis. Maybe that's just always what happens. I don't know. My, what a smashing on I was not expecting to be back here. You wear it well. Weird. Shut up. I look like a twit. The caftan is sewn of the best fabrics available and according to the best tailoring practices. But one must have a modicum of taste to appreciate this. Even the most exquisite robes cover only deficiencies in beauty, never in refinement. How weird. For you, the ending, the ending I'm considering because of Regis. I... Huh, so you can let him live if Sayana dies. I will have to see what that is. That's going to be totally different. I was not expecting that. So us getting the ribbon was important. In, like, many ways. So maybe it wasn't necessarily a positive thing. All, like, it wasn't all positive. But Sayana would have died. Like, okay, huh. Usually wear something different, better suited to my trade. Got nothing against this particular outfit, though. Just don't exactly feel comfortable in it. And I despise formal occasions. Hmm. Nothing one can't get accustomed to. Now, be so kind as to stand still. All that being as it may, Toussaint's highest honor, the Order of Vitis Vinifera, demands appropriate attire. The Duchess cannot be expected to drape the medal on a suit of armor caked in mud. Palace protocol places enormous emphasis on form, virtuous tradition, etiquette. Yes, huh. yes. A tradition which values appearances ahead of all else, which calls for lordly, glistening triviality, and misplaced generosity. Mm hmm Sound wistful. Pensive, Regis. That because they refuse to buy you a new outfit? Hardly. It's the tone I ever adopt when I find myself pondering, which, believe it or not, happens quite a lot. Besides, I've no need for a new outfit as I shall not be attending the ceremony. Why not? Because unlike you, I don't have to. I shall begin to pack my belongings instead. I trust you'll join me later, once you're richer by a medal and a fascinating new experience. Indeed, Count on it. Okay, wait, you guys, look at this cat right now. It's just... Hello, yes, you. You're so cute, you're just all flooped. Yes, oh my. Oh my. You're so cute. Oh, you're gonna get my sweater. Uh-oh. Gonna add some extra holes to the holy sweater. Oh, Ozzy's in the cubby back here, too. That's that the little lump is Ozzy. Oh, how cute. Yes, you guys are so cute. Can you let go? Thank you. Adorable. Okay, anyways, can't interruption. Hmm. <laughs> Ceremonies. Medals honoring virtues. Just keeps coming up. I've had no reprieve either, and I keep thinking of the last great virtue, compassion. It's the one piece of the puzzle that never seemed to fit. Mean you suddenly believe the five virtues theory, after all we've revealed? It's not a question of belief, superstition, or old wives' tales. It's a conclusion derived through exercising pure logic. Siana planned everything in advance. Had we not stopped her, surely there'd have been a fifth victim. One the gossips would have associated with a lack of compassion. Her plans don't matter now. Can't act on them. Ask the messenger who delivered my invitation to the ceremony. Siana's in the palace. Courtiers pressured the Duchess to lock her in a tower. Do you care not a whit who else was in her black book? 
We've some time before the ceremony. We could still chat with that boot-cleaning urchin. He was the one to pass the victims' names to Detlaf. Perhaps we missed something. Okay, so we did this yesterday. We might as well just go do this real quick, because we know what's going on. So, let's go. All in all, why not check up on that? We'll go together, assuming we're done here. Oh, I, I wonder if things done. are going to be different with yes. Sayana now. It lies in your hands now to see if you are able to present or if she's still my handiwork her sister. at the ceremony with the dignity it is due. Or if you will first destroy it, crawling about the city's underbelly. Promise to be careful. I was not expecting the ribbon to be the deciding factor in all of this. Like, what? Oh, it's the swordsman. Good to see you. Here for a spiffing? Dirty boots are a stain on professional dignity, you know. Step on up. Need to ask you something. Yet again? Go on, then. I'm a proponent of free speech, and I will gladly tell you all I know. But why not... Okay, get you signed. He's like, yes. Guess they could use a spit and polish. Then I shall take advantage as well. A friend of mine used to say boots should be as clean as the soles that wear them. Clean boots, clean soles. A fine slogan. Okay, so... Man in a frock coat. Him you things. passed him some letters, but remember? Why, of course. I'm young, got a mind like a steel trap, but... No, more money. If you're about to tell me this information will cost me, forget it. How'd you get those letters? Beckers brought them. Did us giving him money earlier have any effect on this, or no? Beggars. Tell us more about them. How many were there? Why, four. One for each letter. Just four? Sure you didn't get a fifth? I can't count, you know. Remember anything else? These beggars have anything in common? What? Come now. It was... Nope. Oh! I know! They all had no home! Wow! Kid, my patience is starting to run a little thin. Now think hard. Remember what they looked like? Of course. I've a mind like a steel trap, as I said. As you said. They were ragged, unshaved. Their clothes were tattered. As to their boots, well, I mentioned that already. Geralt, allow me to ask a question. Listen, lad. I'll be glad to mix another batch of that boot shine for you. But you must focus now and tell us all you know. Where can we find the beggars? Well, at the shelter, most like. Where's that? Everyone knows. It's just round the corner. Up those stairs, then right. Thanks, kid. For your trouble. Thank you. We must visit the shelter. Look around inside. No, our investment didn't affect it. All right, just was curious. Price list. Price list, huh? 20 crowns for the leather boots, polish, and shine. Without shine, not recommended. War veteran price. Oh, metal cleaning, armor cleaning. Oh, dear. You have something to be cleaned that is not on the price list. I can clean it. Come a mess, leave well dressed. You'll see I'm the bleeding best. Respect it. Wait, I... I won't take his leather, but I do want to take the leather. Thank you for the, the performance. Oh, we're carrying too much. I'm like, huh? Yeah, we've been like carrying a lot of things for a while. For like a good long time. Um, we need to dismantle like a lot of this stuff. Did you see them? The vampires? Mm -hmm. You've to move your little camp elsewhere. My strength's gone. This is a decent here. district. We need no filth folk. Hello there. You? What do you want? To talk. 
Here, that's a waste of breath. We've tried it, only to tire our lips. We'll use other means of persuasion no, now. really now. Gentlemen, calm, please. Either get out along with these flea-ridden vagabonds, or we'll toss you all out. Our patience is gone. Mm -hmm. This place is no longer a rank refuse dump. Scram! Decent folk live here. And you are the judge of that, yeah? Decent folk you mention. Mean yourselves. Why? Do you doubt it? Hell yes. Hear that, Artois? He poking insults us. On our own turf. We should step aside, good fellow. My friend is perfectly capable of settling this unfortunate dispute on his own. Oh, we gotta punch him. Okay, alright, here we go. I have 30 rotting flesh. That's good. Okay, no. I almost dumped my guts in fear. Yeah. Should I put on some heavy armor in case I get hit? That's not considered cheating. Oh, what? What? Huh? Oh, that just brought me to the, the quest items. It put the quest pants back. <sighs> Fine, it's for the quest. It's for the quest. I'll just leave it. No armor needed. Just beat him up. Here we go. You are one damn squib. <laughs> Never find a witcher. Got him. Oh, All right. what was that move? I can take a hint. Come, time to go. I thank you so much for your aid. I tried to reason with them, but they, they have beat me blue had you not come along. I'm grateful. Immensely. What did they want from you? They are neighbors. Wish me to take my folk, the shelter, elsewhere. They dislike that I help the beckers. I do not oppose going elsewhere were we to have somewhere to go. But you've come with a problem, have you? My turn to hate you. Yes, info. Need some information. Looking for a man who might have mentioned the boot black in Rue de Girl. The boot black? A feisty lad. I know him. Any of your, uh, wards supposed to meet him recently or soon? Forgive me. Those I help and I are not so close that I would know. But should you wait, they'll all soon come for their meal. You can question them yourselves. Sounds good. Thanks. We'll wait. Nice of you to let us. Let us? Yeah, no, no witcher signs needed. Just beat him up. My dears, I have a matter to address before I serve this soup. These two gentlemen have some questions of you. Pay attention, answer in brief, for if you draw it out, your soup will go cold, and we wouldn't want that, would we? Recently, four of you delivered sealed letters to the boot black. I know this. Yes. Speak up, please. Does anyone know what the gentleman means? Go on, speak up. Romain? Why should I squeal? We were all told not to mention the letters. We all swore. You can tell me, Romain. You were given a letter and you delivered it, right? Yes. Good work, Romain. Thank you. Who else? I got the one, too. Gave it to the boot black. And Freshy, he got one. But he can't tell you, as he's not here. I still have mine. I'm to deliver it two days after the Feast of St. Barnabas. There it is. Letter, please. It's a matter of importance to the duchy. Hand it over, or I'll take it from you, plain and simple. But I was to deliver it personally. Let no one else see it. That is what she said, and she was frightening. You ought to heed folk who are kind and honest. This man helped me a short while ago, helped all of us. 
If this individual threatened you, you need not keep the promise you made. All right. Take it. I didn't want to see the boot black anyways. It's always muddy there. Okay. Damn it. What is it? Yeah, so Another we know who it truly? is from See yesterday. Hana, no. Well, well. Not the Duchess. I I must say, even I did not expect this. This time you will see to our Duquesa. Uh -oh. It seems we underestimated Siano. So I wonder if this is Judging gonna by end this, any differently. Detloff was literally I'm worried. supposed to tear her heart out. Yet first you must snap her neck. Puzzling. Really looks like I shouldn't have found the uh the ribbon. I feel like I should have just let Sienna die. I shouldn't have gotten something to protect her. I should have thought about that more. Dang. Puzzle complete now. Alas, the matter's ceased to be a tantalizing brain tease and has turned incredibly grave. We've proof of a plot to assassinate Toussaint's ruler. We've proof of a coup d'etat. Yeah, I'm assuming things are going to be a bit different now, so let's let's see if I can have a better ending. Duchess was to be Detloff's last victim. Sienna planned it from the start. Indeed. The logical conclusion, Geralt. Four seemingly random victims to start. The virtue's their only link. Enough to get folk talking about a righteous, vengeful beast. Obscured the victim's links to Sienna, even as she had mm. those she despised killed off one by one, yes. leaving the Duchess for last. Had she managed to fulfill her plan, none would have questioned the reasons. Most would have thought Anna Henrietta had died for her sins. She was known to show a hard heart on many occasions, ample proof of a lack of compassion. Why would Sienna murder her own sister? Out of envy? To take power? From an inborn penchant for evil? Yes, Carol, you kinda yes, know. and yes. All seem likely, and none are mutually exclusive. But if you'd like to know for certain, you could always ask her yourself. Think it's a good idea? After all, we foiled her carefully planned scheme. Think she'll even want to? Talk to you? Would it harm you in any way to try? Some philosophers think empirical examination the sole path to knowledge. I believe you mentioned the Duchess keeps Siana locked up. Courtiers were insisting on a harsher punishment. Much harsher. Think Anna Henrietta had to protect her sister from a lynch mob as much as she wanted to protect her subjects from a criminal. One way or another, she's locked away in a secluded wing of the palace, awaiting trial before a court of law. I'd need to get past some guards to see her. Catch you later. So, meet up once it's over? Assuming you'd rather not see Sienna again. You assume correctly. He's like, yeah. I shall await you at Mer Lachaise Long with a hot mug of mandrake brew to keep me company. Enjoy. And hungry. So, we don't have to talk to Sienna, but. Like we should. See what new dialogue Oop. she has for us. Because yep. she's definitely I'm gonna going have to something she... to say to us. Because she's already kind of given us her initial backstory, which is all we got here at this point yesterday. We were not very friendly with her, so. If you think killing the beast gets you in for free, this is not going how I expected. I thought that I would be more prepared for this, considering that I saw an ending yesterday, but no. No. She's evil. What, Sienna? I mean, yeah, no, like, I'm not, I'm not her biggest fan. Um, she's plotting to kill her sister and do, like, a whole brutal thing, so, like, just because her sister didn't rescue her. And there may be a lot of reasons for that. No, no talking about it, just, just murder. And then take over. Like, okay. That's good. Up we go. Ooh. 
Halt! Need to see Siana urgently. In the matter of? Need to interrogate her. New facts have come to light. Need them explained. Seems she was planning your Duquesse's assassination. Ah, fine then. You're that witcher who solved the murders, no? Then you've my permission, but only for a few minutes. Promise to be brief. Here we go. The Witcher will speak with the inmate. You can take a momentary break. As long as it's truly but a moment. Highly irregular, this. They're like, what? Weird. Irregular. How dare they? Have you come to see how I fare? I'm fine, thank you. Artorius's Ripon worked wonders. It's a shame they took it from I me. I know who the fifth victim was supposed to be. Hmm. Goodness, you're simply a compulsive snoop. I'm in prison. Deadlaf is dead. Could you not just drop it? Sienna, stop pretending you couldn't care less. I know it's an act, and it's really starting to wear. Why do you want to oh, kill Jesus her? She's just acting this whole time. For such an accomplished investigator to ask about the obvious. Come now, Geralt. Why do you think? Because she forgot about you? Because she turned her back on you, then banished all memory of you? Bravo, Geralt. Bingo. Yet another riddle solved, Woo. and your sick curiosity sated. Well, what now? Off to share your discovery with Anna Henrietta. Oh, she's no longer in danger, true. But she very well might add a little something to your reward. Definitely gonna tell her. Not necessarily for the coin, though. Then why do it at all? She ought to know. If only because you'll probably try to kill her again if she ever lets you out. After the clouds? I probably will. This? <laughs> Okay, so I have three options here. Ah, honesty, finally, which... Fair. Ever thought to forgive her? I think I've heard enough. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna go with one of the first two. So, honest, I feel like this might work with her, but I'm gonna see the, the forgiveness route. Perhaps, just for a second, you could stop dwelling on all the wrongs folk have done you. And forgive her. Why should I? For old time's sake. You loved each other once. <sighs> Please. I don't know who fed you that rubbish, but... Read your governess's diary. You played together. We're inseparable. Honoria did get you into trouble sometimes, sure. But there were also times she stood up for you. This is important. When you had nightmares, only she could call me. Ah. Time eats away at memories, distorts them. Sometimes we only remember the good, sometimes only the bad. Oh. If she loved me so, why did she wash her hands off me? Forget me, hmm? I don't know what to do. We're not in the clear yet. We're not in the clear yet. I think we go for the she's a child option, right? Like, yeah, uh... I, I think saying might ask her that, she's just gonna dismiss that. That's a bit dismissive, so... Let's try? Sienna, you were exiled when she was how old? 12? 13? She was a child. What was she supposed to do? Rebel? Organize a coup? Steal your father's seal and forge a pardon? She was powerless. Wiped you from her memory not because she didn't care, but because your departure was traumatic for her. She forgot because that was the only way she could handle the pain. Oh. Yeah, they both got... Ugh. You really want a happy ending, don't yes, you? Yes, I do. <laughs> Please. 
Ah, with all of us living happily ever after. Mine is dead. Go, life. Witcher. Or they'll give your medal to another. And that would be a shame. Farewell, Sienna. So am I still gonna have the option to tell Anna about I don't know if it would even matter anyways. I don't know, we're gonna see. Okay, hang on. Commander de la Tour would like to see you. Shall we go at once? Let's go. Want to see him too. Damien. Geralt, it's about time. Ready for the ceremony. I'm gonna make sure that I tell him. Okay, so I told him yesterday it didn't help. Um, we're trying to go with the forgiveness option. We're trying to go with the forgiveness option. I'm gonna give Sienna Okay, what do I what do I want to do? Even if it doesn't have like a giant impact, like I what what would I do here? I don't know. Like I don't think I would tell him. Because I'm I'm expecting her to have uh, forgiven. Okay, but from what I did last time okay, I might just do what I did yesterday and tell him, but not her? Maybe he should know. It wasn't anything great. They didn't like chop off her head or anything. So like, all right. Got some important information. Anna Henrietta was supposed to be Detloff and Siana's fifth victim. You are certain of this? Completely. Found proof. Inconceivable. How could she? The murders, the mayhem she brought down on the city were they not enough? She sought to strike down her own sister, her liege, traitor. I must alert my men. Enlarge the Duchess's honor guard. Make certain Sylvia Anna is closely watched during the questioning. I'll see to it personally. I thank you, Witcher, for alerting me. And I appreciate your attentiveness. Let's begin the ceremony. Come with me. The Duchess awaits. Oh, goodness. Okay, I don't know what's right right now. I guess I could tell her, not him, but it's like... I don't know, at this point I guess In I tell both Guild's of them. In the guild's name, I beg your assistance, your enlightened highness. Let's Without see. barrels, production <laughs> will come to a stop and it will be the end of us. You lost them all in the fire. These are horrible tidings. Oh, we are most dreadfully saddened. Yes, your enlightened highness all. Once the beasts had clawed their way into the warehouse, the whole place went up in flames. I shall dispatch a palace guardsman to examine the site of the blaze. If things are as you say, fitting compensation shall be paid from the ducal treasury. Hooray. Thank you, your enlightened highness. Your grace, Geralt of Rivia has arrived. My dear subjects, we come now to our next point of business. Of all the duties which fall upon my shoulders, as the ruler of this dominion, this duty is dearest to my heart. For now, we shall award the Order of Vitis Vinifera, Tucson's highest honor. Geralt of Rivia, Slayer okay. of the Beast of Beauclair. 
Step forth. Hurrah. <coughs> we bestow the distinction upon the Witcher, who saved Beauclair from the terrible beast. Such is our desire. May this symbol serve as a reminder to all that the Witcher shall forever remain a friend of Beauclair. Woo! In more familiar terms now, I thank you immensely, Geralt. Damien has your reward for you. After all, it was but a contract. Money. Thank you. I have a small surprise for you, in addition. I give you okay. more than a dozen barrels of Son Real, a wine normally reserved for the ducal table. The gustatory experience of a lifetime awaits. Are you content? I don't know what to do! Okay, so yesterday... So yesterday, we... We had some similar, similar sort of things, but, um, we didn't go Sayana's whole route. Um, and we didn't have all of that with her, and we were, like, kind of, like, an enemy of her. Um, and went the whole vampire route and all. Um, I didn't tell her. I told the guards, and I didn't tell her, and they, she super died. Like, she super got stabbed by Sayana. I told Sayana to forgive this time, though. So, like... You guys are torn about it also, so I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to tell her. I'm going to tell her because I didn't tell her yesterday. I'm going to tell her specifically because I didn't tell her yesterday. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see. Like, <laughs> I don't know. That's a tough one. Um... I'm really just, I'm tempted to not kill her just because, like, Sayana's trying to be forgiven. But, like, most people... <sighs> we saved before all of this business, but, like... No, I'm not... I thought it was not the moment yesterday, but then she died. So I don't know if she's still gonna die right now. Like, is it not the moment? Like, is she not gonna like this? Is she not gonna like this? <laughs> I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say. I am, and truly grateful, Your Grace. I'm Sadly, sorry. I am afraid I have to sour the mood. I took 100 years. It's okay. And Sienna, she plotted to have you killed, Duchess. Planned to use Deadloff. You were to be the beast's fifth victim. Her face, oh no. This cannot be true. You're mistaken. You must be. I have proof. I do not believe it. Okay. In a moment I shall speak to Siana. Will you assist me? You returned my sister to me, yet what you tell me now I find devastating. I've come to doubt that I can judge her fairly. I'd far prefer to learn you're mistaken, Geralt. I have no I'm idea not. if that matters, or in fact, I, I'm I'd so scared. You be particularly careful around her. You exaggerate, Witcher. She is my sister. I know well how to speak to her. If my presence will help in any manner, of course I'll stay. We shall now question a person implicated in the murders which recently ravaged our fair city of Beauclair. Captain de la Tour, show Sylvia Anna in. I'm so scared right now. I'm so scared right now.
The Witcher will take part in our talk. Yep. The Duchess requested I be present. You have committed crimes. Grave crimes. Yet you are my sister. And my heart does not allow me to treat you as a common criminal. Nor does it let me believe you sought my demise. My heart yearns to know you were swayed by the monster Detlaf. You yourself would never stoop so low. Thus I have asked Geralt to advise me. As one impartial. I shall now hear what he has to say. Okay, so I have different options than I had yesterday. So Sayana's clearly guilty, that's all that matters. Or Sayana's crimes were horrible, but she had cause to feel pain. Okay, let's try that. Bitterness consumes Sianna. She had cause to resent many of the court of Beauclair. I know her reasons, understand them even. But I can't condone the actions she chose to take. What is he talking about, Sianna? You know exactly what. I was forcibly exiled, remember? To your benefit. You knew well the throne would then be yours, though I was the elder. The ministers I can understand. They'd hated me since I was a child, thought me a poor prospect for the wife of a duke. I even understand our parents. I'd always sensed the problem. They simply feared me, for I dared to be free. That fabricated curse, it fell into their laps. A gift from above that brought relief. But you... At least we're getting a speech. Your dagger hurt most. You were my honorietta, dammit. My darling little Aww. sister. Now do you understand, Witcher? She so much betrayed pain here. me. Okay, so I'm normally for choosing all the extra options, but sometimes I worry about them, and this is one that I worry about. I... Oh, I worry. I worry. You were children then. You and your sister both had no control over what happened. You're wrong, Witcher. She had control. Remember, dear sister? The day they banished me from the palace. Of course, I'd had the idea to pelt the Nilfgaardian envoy with fish bladders, which we filled with rancid suet on a lark, and which you set afire at the last to impress me, I imagine. And I admit, you did. Hit him right in his hideous bald patch. Never laughed so hard in my life. But when it came time to find the culprit, you said not a word. I took all the blame and all the punishment. It's true. So you're gonna kill her? Because she didn't I stand did up for you as a kid? I did not stand up for you. Wow. I was too afraid. Therapy? Oh, no. oh. <clears throat> the council was unanimous. Like, can we help they listed or? all my offenses. My come on, come on, come on. Oh no, is she supposed it act? No, she has the hand behind the back. She has the hand behind the back. She has the chips. No. They cast me out. No. But you, the uh -oh. only one uh -oh. to understand me. You cowered in a corner, lifted not a finger to help. Not before, not after. Guys. You never tried to find me. That's not true. I searched for you. Oh, she sent did look out for knights, her. gathered she did. tidings from without. You did not wish to be found. Since the day you vanished, I have lived with the knowledge that I failed you. I'm sorry, dear sister. Can you forgive me? Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh? No, don't, don't. The hairpin, the hairpin, the hairpin. I'm so scared, I'm so scared. I'm so scared, the hairpin.
keep your eyes closed. Happy, happy, right? Oh, we're actually fading away. Oh my god, did we actually do it? She did. Oh my god! Oh my god, we did it! Oh my god, we did it! All in all, oh my god, you got it. The whole ceremony, <laughs> it was short. Perhaps for you, as you ducked out early, the others are probably just getting started. I was so scared. And drunkenness never ends in this quaint realm. <laughs> Not so fond of Toussaint after all, are we? Oh, this place is like a strong wine, Geralt. Good in small sips. How do you find my personal brew? Not too strong. Just right. Credit the local mandrake of the Alrauna Diabolus variety for that. The tubers which grow in this area's volcanic soil have an altogether unique flavor profile and display a remarkably uncommon dark brown tint. Fascinating. All I can say is this batch turned out excellent. Indeed. Cheers. It might be wise to stockpile some roots for the future. Would you care to accompany me? <laughs> right now in the dark, it's so sassy. Okay, okay. So here's the thing with this ending. Siona and Anna Henrietta, they lived. They, they're happy ending. I'm happy for them. They both had a lot of pain, and I hope that they can work that one out. Um, she did not get stabbed in the heart, which was good news. I was very aware of that hairpin, though. I was very aware of that this time. Did never noticed it before, really. I was focusing on her pretty crown and stuff. Like, not the, not the hairpin pin in the back um anyways she didn't get stabbed but that left died and regis has to leave so basically it seems like our other option was to go see on his route but then to not get the ribbon let Sianna die and then debt laugh goes up and does whatever he's gonna do and then regis does something else that I need to see in the future. So, huh. Okay. <sighs> let's go. If you think it's a good idea, let's go. But I think you might be forgetting one thing. Fresh mandrake root of this variety is highly toxic, even to a witcher. Ah, not a problem. I never forget matters of safety and hygiene in alchemy. Here, gloves and a mask. Don them and you shall be in no danger. Thanks. Right then, let's go. This moonlight... So I said... Yeah, so I, it's interesting. I said, uh... That it, this game is kind of, you know, similar to Cyberpunk, obviously. And... More like Cyberpunk is similar to this game, but you know my point. Um... But the point is... I, there's rarely an all-happy ending. You know... There doesn't really seem to be an option where everyone is happy. Where everyone gets their happy ending. And so I was worried about, like, you know, who wouldn't get their happy ending. I didn't realize that Regis still wouldn't get his whatever. I, I don't know if he has a happy ending in the other one, don't tell me. But, like, I was assuming that something different would happen for him as well as Anna and sister. You know, like, as well as the sisters. But no. And then it seems like, you know, I can help Regis and Detlaf. And then maybe also Anna, but like not Sayana. You know, like, uh, anyways, Anna. Anna and Sayana, I keep mixing up their names, but you get the point. Oh, so dreamy. Penny, for your thoughts. Let me guess. Succubus twins? Huh? No, I was thinking about, oh, how anything can look interesting huh? when properly lit. Even an old necrophage corpse? You've not an ounce of refinement in you, have you? Knew how to brighten up even the cloudiest day. Be prepared. What are these gravestones? A man who would never stoop. Not even for what? Also, our weapon needs repairing. Pain is fleeting, glory is forever. Hmm. Whoop. 
Oh, the mask. Oh, I didn't put on the mask this time. And the gloves. Oops. I... <laughs> I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Gosh dang it. Consume. <coughs> that does not seem to help. Okay, we... Uh... Well, that's what happens if you don't put them on. Oops. Where are they, though? Is that it? You know, at this point, we're already... It's fine. Where's the thing? Um... Where's the other one? Where is it? Come on. Uh... Um, maybe... I just did a whole circle. Oh, there it is. There it is. <coughs> I was gonna say, I can't get more intoxicated. Can I? Or, um... I mean, yeah, technically. I, yes, no, we definitely can. We can make it worse. Cool. Sorry, Geralt. You're fine. You're fine. Yes. You've survived worse. Now, where'd that bloodsucker go? Won't be easy to track down. He's a vampire, after all. Yes. Regis! Regis. Damn it, where'd you go? Across the river, through the woods. Regis! You raise your hand against the vampire! I did what I... Huh? Those Bruxae, they called you a traitor. Oh, this happened Alas, last time too, where I killed them before they could even speak. Honor, we vampires. So simple you might call it trivial. Either one is with us, unconditionally, regardless of the circumstances. Art is too powerful. Won't let it go, will they? They should have made him stronger. They will not. Fortunately, we have another rule, an unwritten one, and just as trivial as the first. It is neatly summarized in the saying, out of sight, out of mind. That is why I must leave Toussaint, for a vastly long time, most like. Yeah, I get it. Uh, let us make for my camp. I have an overwhelming desire to have another drink. Cheers. That's the dialogue again. I know. That's. Mmm. Supreme bouquet. I'm Firm, just... defined I'm... beginning. I'm then so I'm... used to going into a battle and pressing art. <laughs> That's good. Um. Oh, I can't believe we're wrapping this game up again. I absolutely can't believe it. What a, what a game. Beautiful. Also, if you guys have missed any of the previous parts of the playthrough, up on YouTube. Thank you. Rising to a, a startling finish, don't you think? Not much of a connoisseur. Then it is high time you started your education. After all, the Corvo Bianco Vineyard is now yours. Yes, it is. By the way, I left a gift for you at your new home, on the nightstand. <laughs> Thanks. Mind telling me what it is? Ugh, a trifle. That will nonetheless be useful should you need mutagens. Nice. Incidentally, have you thought about what you'll do with your prize? Shall you hang your swords over the mantle and take to pruning vines? I said I don't know, but I know that Yen comes to visit, so... Yeah. Know what? Think I just might. <laughs> Come on now, don't laugh. Maybe not today or tomorrow. But one day I'll want to see what it's like... to just wake up every day in my own bed. Oh, stop, please. Sounds so sentimental, my fangs have begun to hurt. Then what? Will you begin writing your memoirs like Dandelion? Like Dandelion, huh? I can remember a night, not too far from here, if I'm not mistaken, 
We hid in a cave while a blizzard raged all about. Does that sound at all familiar? How could it not? We just set off to rescue Ciri from Vilgefortz. Oh, our encounter with Vilgefortz. That is something I do not remember so fondly. But that first stain, Beauclair, far calmer than this one. Seemed like a land straight out of a fairy tale back then. Its sole problem, cellar's too small to accommodate all that wine. Appearances, Geralt. Appearances like Mamoons and Dopplers deceive. So what did become of Vilgefortz? Killed him. Sure wasn't easy, though. Can't wait to go read all the books. I can't wait. What about you? Any Thank idea you. where you'll go? Sorry, he has to leave. Distance is of the essence. I thought I might venture south. Nilfgaard? Why ever not? The Nilfgaardians are a modern society. None there believe in vampires anymore. This fact alone could be very useful to one wishing to remain incognito. Hmm. Interesting point of view. We'll miss him. <sighs> I so don't feel like going anywhere. Sit here a while longer. The chills. So we shall, my friend. We have witnessed, and in fact on several occasions incited, many great and weighty events. After all that toil, I believe we deserve a bit of a rest. That we do. Not the look at the camera, like, oh my god. Ah! Ah! <laughs> I don't even know what to do. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I know that there's technically a third ending to that. We'll, we'll see that eventually, but... That might be for a future playthrough also. I don't know. We'll see. Oh my god. Right, the base game other ending? Oh. We'll get there. I would like to do that. Give me, give me a minute, though. I'd like to switch it up with some other games. So that we can come back and fully appreciate this game again. You know, we need we need some contrast, right? <laughs> Incredible. We also need some time to cap up, catch up with the YouTube uploads, right? <laughs> oh wow, you guys. Okay, I know it's not fully fully done, but like we've also technically seen the end there. Yeah, what a game! So these will be up on YouTube and everything. I'll probably put this one up there too, because why not? Um, might as well have it, and we got the VOD channel there, also a separate YouTube channel in case you guys just want to see the full livestream archive. Um, and of course you're on Twitch. The VODs only stay up for 60, 60 days, though, max, so, just so you guys know. Back to Baldur's Gate 3? I mean, I'm not opposed to finishing up our playthrough. But also, I'm not opposed to waiting just a minute on that one, doing some other stuff first. Like, I don't know, it kind of depends. Um, I do want to check out some Final Fantasy games. I want to play some Skyrim again. I want to, Skyrim's my most played game and I haven't played in like a good while. My most streamed game too, but again, been a while. Um, what else? God of War, we got to play through through the God of War series. I don't know, there's a bunch of really good series I, I wanna look at, even like Bioshock and some different like other ones that like I've missed in the past, like kind of depending on timing, Plague Tale and some some other ones that uh, seem like good games that I just have never had the chance to play. Even like the Halo games, I've never played the Halo games. Do you guys be interested in seeing those at all? I'm just curious. <clears throat> I was talking about those the other day and I was like, huh, never really played those. I made the same mistake you did the first time. He yeah, decided to forceful shove was needed. Yeah, with the extra. Yeah, I kind of had, I don't know. I wanted to see what was going on there. Oof. The Empress ending requires a long backtrack. Okay. Well, one thing I don't, okay. So I'm not able to load my old PC saves right now until we get a new PC. <laughs> um, I had to transfer 
the latest save over to the PS5 in order to continue streaming. Um, I'm on a borrowed PC at the moment that is very temporary. And yeah, so that it's a bit of a temporary thing. So we can't really do anything like that until uh, we get the better setup anyways and, and all of that. So we're going to be playing some PS5 games for a second until we get a new graphics card. <laughs> yeah, so anyways, um, there are plenty of PS5 games to play, to be fair. And that's part of why I was looking at Final Fantasy and all of that in general, because um, those are all on the PS5. So that's what's going on uh, technically. It's filling you guys in. Um, we've already made incredible progress um, towards the, the new GPU and stuff, and if some things need to be rushed and all, like, you know, we'll take it from there. But PC's in, in the shop this weekend. Um, we will have the confirmation on the Toasted Graphics card very soon. So it's going to be, yeah. <laughs> Spider-Man? Oh, that'd be a random one, but it could be kind of cool. Hmm. Okay, let me... Let me get past this. Uh, actually, I'd love to go home. Go home? Oh, yes, we'll have to go home. Do we just run there? No. Let's run here. Yeah, but I'd love to play some more Skyrim. Skyrim Nolus? What is that? Yeah, God of War, I will totally play through. Totally. Soon. Get an Xbox? I know. I I will consider getting an Xbox one of these days. I've been thinking about it. I want to play some Red Dead 1, too. <laughs> Look at our beautiful, beautiful house. Look at it. Where's our benches? There's the grindstone workbench. Cool. You tell you worked the beast? Wine. White wolf. Skeleton always been there. It's good. That we could do later if we need. Don't stick to me. Even a horse drops you right if you don't stick And then there's also Master Witcher. Some unknown individual barged into the residence. I resisted as best I could, but to no avail. Who is it? Alas. They did not do me the basic courtesy of introducing themselves. Yeah, it sounds like Yennefer. I was immediately suspicious of Yennefer as soon as he said that. It's like, what? Didn't ask for permission, just went right in? Yeah, that's Yennefer. <laughs> I feel like Triss might introduce herself. I don't know. We need to get to know Triss more in another, another playthrough. <laughs> Unexpected as ever. Oh. And beautiful as ever. Won't you even ask why I've come? Or how I found you? Wouldn't get a straight answer anyway. Quite true. Used to bother me all your secrets. Now I know if you have something to tell me, you'll tell me. Don't need to ask. I missed you, Geralt. Madly. Come outside. We can hold hands and so stare cute. at the sky. Like <laughs> some shitty two-crown romance. You can have Siri or Dandelion show up depending on story choices. That's so fun! Dandelion can show up? That's interesting. Oh, we technically, we heard a lot of this yesterday, but I'm cool to just hear that. quite a few stuff. books. Let me guess. Working on a new spell? Not at all. These aren't grimoires, just pleasure reading. The name of the Orchid. 
A no, widower sir. for half a year. <laughs> Always thought you too busy to make time for something as impractical as pleasure reading. Because I was. But now, I'm not. Now she's got time for her reading, A few right? weeks ago, I awoke to the realization that I know not what to do next. I have no plan. I have no goal. And you know what? I like that. Finally, I can stop thinking about politics and focus on what's important to me. Unicorns. Which is why I came here. <laughs> why is there a couch? I'm assuming because Yennefer made a couch. That's my guess, but I don't know. Having a house feels strange. You know, feels kind of strange having a home. Hmm, I must say I never pictured you owning real estate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Was something of an accident, but I'm not about to complain. Yen, back then, before we fought the hunt, said you wanted to run away with me to the world's end. This vineyard, good enough? Hmm, yes. So cute. Although, there's one thing missing. Namely? I shall give you a hint. It's large white, has four legs, category taxidermy. Mm. Oh yeah, the unicorn. Mm -hmm. Fine, you can bring it down here. Where's Unicorn I Roach? I you'd see things my way. Actually, keep Unicorn Roach out of this. Ever thought this day would come? Me and you, peace and quiet, bees buzzing, birds chirping. I almost regret delaying so long before coming to you. I was quite the silly goose. You have doubts? Though I imagine it might have been hard coming after me. Always were proud as a peacock. Please, Geralt. I'm not like other sorceresses to feel that following someone means my wings have been clipped. Ooh, watch what you say about your colleagues. Remember, it's an ill bird that fouls its own nest. <laughs> well said, Witcher. You're not only handsome, but wise, too. I feel a bit like the cat that got the canary. Yeah, and I'm... Mm. Damn it, you win. This time. Ha! How'd that start, anyway? Our duels in wordplay. Forgotten. It was at a vernissage in Bannard. I'm just you hearing started them talk. to keep from going mad with boredom. I remember finding your sense of humor both groan-worthy and somehow endearing. Never change, Geralt. I beg you. Oh. We also saw the 10 year anniversary trailer so, yesterday. So talk cute. Again later. Of course. I'm not going anywhere. So cute. Oh my gosh. I'm not going anywhere, Jennifer. Jennifer, I love you. Um, <clears throat> anyways. Wow, oh, what a game, what a story. We got our, um, our gift from, oh! Can we just, in here as well. What's on the stand, armor stand? Yes, we've expanded. Oh, I didn't mean to go to sleep. I guess we're, I guess we're going to sleep. All right, yep, yeah, now we've actually committed to Yennefer. No one else. We, we've committed. We're living the, our life out on on the farm. All right. We, we must resist everyone else now. <laughs> hmm, already far beyond the borders of Tucson, and now you have found my muted generator. Yes, we read about what it does. Yes, yes, yes. Cool. We charge it up. You must know I did it out of modesty, believe it or not. Oh my, Regis. Oh my. So cute. Alright, guys. I think that is it. I think that's about as good of a happy ever after as we're gonna get for this. We'll have to see what the, the third possibility is on a future run, I think. I think we'll save it for for another one, you know? And that is going to conclude our time playing The Witcher 3. Wild. I can't believe it is actually, like, 
actually that time. Okay, so I'm happy that I actually have both of these save slots because one of these is before the ribbon. This is before the ribbon. Right? I think this was before the ribbon or did I get the ribbon already? I thought I did. I thought I went up there and then was like, wait, the rainbow. And then I went to get the ribbon. I might have already gotten it already. I probably did. Don't know. Anyways, I'm just trying to figure out where to save this save. I'm going to put this one. I'm going to put that right there. Beautiful. And there concludes our Witcher 3 playthrough. Oh my gosh. Like, round of applause, everyone, right? <laughs> and now we all clap or something. Like, oh my goodness. I... I, like, actually can't believe it. Yeah, okay, let's get out of here. Um... Wow. What are we gonna do without listening to, like, our Witcher tavern music all the time? I don't... I don't know what we're gonna do. <laughs> what, a, what an amazing time. Watch Dandelion's ending. See, but what if I wanna do a future playthrough? What if I get Dandelion's ending? I'm assuming that like, is maybe what you get if you like romance no one or like certain thing, like, I don't know, maybe romance both them? I feel like that's what you get if you romance both Triss and Yennefer. And I feel like Siri would be if you romance no one. That's just my initial like instincts on that though. I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> Do we need a clap command? That'd be a good one. At least Dio made himself comfortable. <laughs> I love it. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, tough. You can't name the manual saves. I like that that's a, a feature on a lot of newer games. Yeah, it's like actually kind of over now. I know. No, we will play the whole game again. I just give me a minute. I need to- I need to switch it up. I- I think we need a break from The Witcher. As much fun as I had with this. We were at this for over two months straight. Like, we- we streamed a lot, and we were at this for over two months straight. <laughs> so I'm like, yeah, we need- we need just a sec before we go back to this. Of course, a future playthrough will definitely be faster, and with New Game Plus and everything, and not wanting to do, like, every single side quest in the game. Like we basically did. We did most every- most all of them. Not every single one, but like most all of them. Like we were pretty damn close. So like, you know? Um, 